Well, here we are in France now. This is the outside of the main entrance. There's the alleyway down. There's a little car park up there. So we one step and up we go and into what is now our kitchen. There you go. There's the two beautiful mahogany windows. And look at the view outside there. There's a rose from England and pictures from Ireland. We brought them over. Curtains picked by England. And out the window we have Michelle doing some work there. There's the garage we didn't buy for an extra three grand. And look at that. That is the sea down there. The sea. So I pull back and I have a look around. There's the fire. We're going to change the fireplace before we have do anything else with it. That's the kitchen built in. A little bit of paintwork needed. Um, the monk's bench has storage underneath there. A little bit of touching up. There's a nice big beam. So on into the salon. Here's the sitting area. Night, nice in the summer now. The sun comes right in there to hit you. That's a nice uh, wooden floor I put in last summer. It's a little drinks bench I put in there last um made that last year we got it from Apple and there's out the window again again the sun comes in there it's quite beautiful that um, futon there turns into a bed as well when when needed at night so now I'll zoom in there yeah look at that wow there you go so into the utility room the utility room isn't by any means finished I spent a lot of time fixing up the wiring and the floor it needs doing the walls need painting just needs a little bit of touching up probably more decoration the plumbing there as you can see it needs just kind of boxing in but I thought that was a tough job I might box that in yet but um, it was just wires everywhere when I got here this trip March 2006 yes there's clothes there dry little baby lie there the chairs I think are beautiful they were with an old table set there again is the drinks cabinet untouched of course I don't drink so here we go into the bathroom shower area well I suppose bathroom there's a nice sink there's me I took the door right? look at that I made that myself last summer quite beautiful very impressed and there is the salle de bain we oui. I was on douche look at that we had an infestation of ducks I don't know how to get rid of them ducks so I have to think about something there um, maybe a dog or something and my luminaire so the bathroom of all things is pretty much finished just needs a bit of um kind of reorganising with my mouthwash so here we go there's the spirals there's the escalier spiral so kitchen door again needs touching up need lights there in the kitchen as well so up we go come on everybody Woo. up we go there now one two there's 14 steps I think to the top as you can see we pause here to look at all my books on the war D-Day and stuff like that that are there for anyone who wishes to have a perusal there's a hoover Ingrid knows more about that than I um, and the shelf the, the kind of house was finished in such a way that the wall plate sat on the outside with a big shelf there to sit on and we can use that for ornaments and stuff so the notorious beams look at the beams the amount of work that went into them you would only cry at they were in pretty much a state prior to getting the house um, they were actually hidden a lot of them so we had to strip them so we're into Jessica's room the heaters are working there now and, and there's the beautiful beams and I think they've turned out quite well we still might need to paint Jesse's ceiling. Oh, there's a kind of deja vu a moment. But there you go. There's another shelf. And again, I think they were good because they left ample room for space and stuff. So there's little animals I made for Jesse last year and the, the telescope to see the spire of the church. If there's any snipers in it, the church are going to see now. Curtains again, picked by Ingrid. So that's the church there in Villarville somewhere. Um, the top of it was blown off during the war because there was a, a German spotter up there and uh, he died eventually too feel across the road there and there's a castle just to the right you can see michelle's flag flying there that's his weather vane but across the road there yeah, during the d-day celebrations they fitted with tanks and cars and all so it's quite fun again my spiral stairs now the back bedroom or the main room here we go it's pretty much kind of in storage at the moment more beams here they, these were tough ones down and again they were all covered before um, we bought the house and uh, everything was kind of covered in a beauty board and horribleness so it was a dirty filthy job trying to clean them again the lovely shelf we can uh, put stuff on and here's our moquette our carpet it's, it's pretty hard and it's good stuff um that'll last a few years i think yeah it probably needs a bed there just a little bit of touching up but there's plenty of space there that's our storage area in there i have um, hangers and stuff you may have noticed them here okay so again curtains by ingrid we open the back window and we look out at what we can see here. These are our neighbours in Vialpa Samaras. You can see the quite nice house.
houses. That's the road that was built by the military on D-Day to bring their tanks and stuff up like that. Uh, the other road, you can just about see why that White House to the right. Now I'm zooming in on what is a pontoon built by the museum. And there's some cows, I'll probably eat one of them later. But there you go, there's a pontoon built by the museum which was actually used in D-Day. And here are just houses in. A lot of summer houses, I suppose. That's a house being turned into a summer house. It was a shed. And um, that's the shed again we didn't buy for 3000 So there's a car off to the beach for some fun there. If we can see. Ooh, something's just fallen. Oh dear, my mobile phone. Anyway, back out to my fabulous spiral stairs, which took quite a bit of work to do, but it was done. Happy to have done the same, because I think it really adds to the look and feel of the house. Little television, we've a couple of channels, English, French and satellite. Here's my fuse board, there's the kitchen, that's a dishwasher, a cooker, a fridge, freezer. Um, again, the floor, we don't know what to do there, probably a bit of lino and the fireplace again, we'll do something there. So here's our nice double glazed kitchen door. Looking out onto what is very beautiful in the summertime too, we have barbecues out there and we have some pictures online. You can see uh, the, the parties we've had there. Very good neighbours in France. I'm kind of running around because I've only got a minute. We're going on to the other part of the property which we purchased. That was all in the deal for the price. And I haven't really done anything with it. Like that, this was a separate unit. Open the door, you look in. And uh, with my friend John and Kieran and Ian and that, we're going to just go to the place and put a new floor in. And I'll have to see that space there for spiral stairs. Again, there's a window there if you noticed. Looking out onto the beach. There's the satellite dish that blew off in the wind, the old one, that's a little kind of allotment up there. And down the stairs to the lower part of the property, which we purchased again. It's probably a bit scary looking because um, it's a dump, basically. But eventually in time, once I finish here and have time and, you know, a bit of wisdom, maybe we'll, we'll work on in there. So there you go. So we don't have this kind of a uh, shared back garden area. Have a quick look at what the house consists of. Bottom up, that's our salon. Uh, Neighbours on that, and upstairs and upstairs again. That's our house, basically in France. So I've played skills and bowling and, and games with Jesse here, but good fun. Let's uh, dug up a bit because Michelle is doing some work. The people who own that place there who want their kind of shed turned into a summer house. So we got a beautiful stairs. The pool was there to the left, you might have missed it. And down again, there's a big race before it goes to zero, one, two, and back to the hall door. Nice barbecue. Hey.